There is one organ which causes high blood pressure, and it's not what you think. And there are specific exercises you can use to target and fix your blood pressure easily. No diet, lifestyle changes, or medication required. Check the link in the description below, but for now, today's question. It very often is so. But if you have borderline or even stage I hypertension, these non-pharmacological measures are helpful and might help you lower your blood pressure to within normal range. Taken from page on NIH, Governor from Hypertension Webinar 72215 Taken from JCN8 I've seen a man I've seen a man case of beard daily having a really serious hypertension return to normal tension two weeks after stopping his alcohol abuse. Although if one discovers an underlying condition causing hypertension, which is in 5%, so in a minority of people having hypertension, treating this can cure hypertension. In most we just don't know the cause to have to treat the elevated blood pressure to prevent serious complications like stroke, heart failure, kidney failure, heart attacks etc. No, it's not true. But it can be difficult to stop and many people who start taking drugs for blood pressure keep taking them for the rest of their life. The reason it is difficult to stop is because of something called rebound hypertension. When your blood pressure shoots straight up, higher than it was originally, when you stop taking the medication suddenly. Over time your body gets used to the effect of the drug and relies on it, which causes this sudden rise in blood pressure. This doesn't mean you can't stop though, just that you have to stop taking it slowly. If you gradually reduce to dose over a few weeks, your body will readjust slowly and you can avoid rebound hypertension. For example, take half a tablet each day, then half a tablet every second day, until you can stop completely. If you want to manage your blood pressure better, I recommend doing this blood pressure reset challenge. It's completely free, so why not? Sorta. The thing is that taking a pill for your blood pressure doesn't fundamentally change the underlying disease process in your body, so you're controlling symptoms rather than treating the disease. So, yes the likely the answer is you'll need to be on medication to control hypertension. Indefinitely. If you have hypertension due to something within your control, like obesity or smoking, if you change those factors it's possible you might eliminate the hypertension. However, it's not a guarantee. Mostly yes it's a lifetime disease and thus it's a lifetime treatment. I advise you to, 1 take a walk 30 minutes every day to reduce salt intake 3 eat and take 3 eat and fruits 4 reduce fatty meals 5 monitor or blood pressure levels by measurement there's an app where you can add or daily meals blood pressure levels and it measures or physical activity stepwise to read if interested colon slash slash app my care com slash ros slash mmbb 2 lf slb hi actually if the bp drugs were prescribed to you that means something is not working well that is your body is not able to regulate the pressure hence if once the drugs are started you should not stop the drugs till you have sufficiently change the situation inside your body if the pressure comes down then there is no need for the drugs 